bug crawled down in the ground didn't come out for 17 years 17 years 17 years 17 years down in the ground now that little bug is flying all around he's singing his song up in the tree, living his life while in free. Can't you hear him calling? Can't you hear him calling? It's a song of love. It's a song of love. He keeps on a call to another bug. Seventeen years. Seventeen years Seventeen years Down in the ground Now that little bug Is flying all around That old seventeen-year locust Was stuck down in that ground And he wasn't gonna come out Till the bright year rolled around There was a no sunshine And there was a much air Lord, how did he ever make it down there? Betty Bug crawled down in the ground Didn't come out for 17 years 17 years 17 years 17 years Down in the ground Now that little bug Is flying all around Sing his song up in the tree Living his life wild and free Can't you hear him calling? Can't you hear him calling? It's a song of love 
August 2.30 p.m., June the 9th, 2007, and it is a warm, sunny day here in northern Illinois. You can hear the 17-year cicadas singing from the trees and bushes all around. This is truly an historical event in nature. These cicadas are trying out their new wings after spending 17 years down in the ground. They're experiencing the fresh air and sunshine for the first time since they were tiny nymphs. At last, they are completely matured flying adults. These cicadas appear to have little fear of man or beast. There are no signs of any predators right now. Perhaps the noise of their songs has driven away the birds and other enemies. Of course, a lot of animals and birds do consume cicadas. Maybe this is one of their luckier days. After the mating ceremony, the females may lay up to several hundred eggs, which they deposit in slits they cut in twigs and small branches of trees. After about a month, the eggs hatch and the nymphs will fall to the ground where they burrow in. For the next 17 years, they feed on the sap of tree roots. Seventeen-year cicadas are black with red eyes and orange markings. They are smaller than the green and black dog day cicada and sing a different kind of song. These periodical cicadas usually emerge in May or June after their long stay in the ground. This big emergence of cicadas is part of what entomologists call Brood 13 and is representative of the Chicago area. 17-year cicadas emerge in great numbers in different parts of the country at different times. Each group has been labeled a brood number. There are a total of 15 broods. These periodical cicadas are found only in North America and East of the Great Plains. A lot of competition is going on here. These bugs are flying around the trees and bushes like a swarm of bees. It is the mating time of their lives. They have come together in this last great ritual for the sole purpose of seeking out a mate. Their descendants will one day emerge from the earth below 
and once again the distinctive songs of the cicadas will be heard near and far. There is a strong sense of urgency going on here. Time is running out. The days of these cicadas are numbered. It is a strange phenomenon. They are both in their prime and in the old age of their lives. They will all die within a few weeks. The life cycles of these insects have long been a deep, dark mystery. All the time they're down in the ground, their biological clocks are ticking right on cue, and when the Earth's temperature reaches about 64 degrees, they emerge. The timing in the emergings of these cicadas as a group will always revolve to a prime number. It is 17 years in the north, and 13 years in the south. If you listen closely to these cicadas, you can tell there's more than just one kind of song going on. There are three species of the 17-year cicada. Each kind appears a little different with a different song. Some entomologists believe there are also three species of the 13-year cicada, which lives in the south. The sheer numbers of these cicadas help ensure that enough of them will survive to perpetuate their kind. Predators can take their fill without depleting the breeding stock. Because of the odd timing of their emergings, these cicadas do not afford predators a predictable food supply. This is, indeed, cicada country. This is the right time and place to see these bugs in their final days of glory as they fly around searching for mates. It is truly an historical event in nature. A little bitty bug crawled down in the ground Did come out for 17 years 17 years 
17 years 17 years Down in the ground Now that little boat Is flying all around He's singing his song up in the tree Living his life wild and free Can't you hear him calling? Seventeen years, seventeen years, seventeen years, down in the ground. Now that little boat is flying all around. He's saying. 